Hello, no one is available to take your call. Please leave a message after the tone. Hey you, it's me. Just giving you a call to say hi. I've been kind of out of the country for a good minute and I'm back now. So that's why I haven't been really responding to anyone. Um, yeah, so give me a call back. Um, see how you're doing and yeah. Hope all is well and take care. Bye. Two. One. Can we go right back? Back where it used to be. You were my baby. It was just you and me. Yeah, you know, that's a gift from God. That's a gift from God because I was, I don't know, man, like I was literally, I was on my way out the room. And as soon as I was about to touch the doorknob, it just came in, you know, because I thought of a composition in my head, but I had no words. It was just like, can we go? And then the rest, I ran to the mic. And then oh, nice. the instruments weren't even there. Like it was just the metronome. I just said a metronome and was just, I did the harmonies. Can we go right back, back where it used to be, when you were my baby, it was just you and me. July 4th, 2016. <laughs> Which was the most, I said the most crappiest, the, the crappiest day of that year, but the most beautiful night of that year too. Because that's that was the day that I I met her. Yeah, Independence Day is so funny, you know. Yeah, but <clears throat> I was I was in my car. I was parked, and you know I was on freaking I just had it that day man I just was not feeling anything and I was on tinder and I was swiping and I was already tired of that shit it was saying like you know this uh, this doesn't work I'm just so tired nobody matches and why am I constantly swiping and it just uh, I had it and then right before I gave in and just said fuck it her photo came up it like and it just, like I said before, she's breathtaking, you know, and it literally took my breath away. It, you know, I just, like, I was gasping for air, you know, yeah. And her profile, it's like she, you know, her her head was, like, her face was kind of, like, into her uh, her forearm. And you can see her tattoo, you know, her human detail tattoo that I was telling you about. You know, and so I, I went to her. I went to her profile and whatnot, and you know, and f first of all, right away I'm thinking about who she favors. You know, I told you she looks like Jasmine Guy from a different world. You know, which is, she's a very beautiful woman. You know, mm -hmm. and I said this is unreal. Like this is just you know fireworks are going off and everything because it's the Fourth of July. Like behind me and whatnot, or around me. But when I connected, or when I when I laid eyes on her, everything got silent. I couldn't hear anything. You know, it was, it was just like silence. It was just peace like nothing you know mm -hmm. and I was just into her and I said I I have to know this person like 
I, I just felt like, you know, this is it. I got to know who she is. At first, and she doesn't know, you know, like um, <clears throat> sometime back I was telling you, she would say stuff like, well, what made you want to talk to me? Nobody talks to me. Well, the truth is uh, I thought she wouldn't even speak to me or give me the time of day at all, at least, you know, when I first laid eyes on her. But I was like, fuck it, I'm going to try anyway. You know, I'm going to do it because, you know, I make shit happen. I make things happen. And uh, so I waited. I, I, I waited, I think, the next day. It was, yeah, it was the next day I went to go get my hair done. And... I was in I was in a chair and I was with my stylist and she knows, you know, I'm smooth, gentleman. I don't need any help like that. But I was asking her, I was like I was like, uh, can you um I, I don't know I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Uh, you know, I I really wanna get this right. I don't know what to say. Can you, you know, can you help? Is this good? You know, I, I wanna take her out for coffee or I wanna play my cards right because you know, I don't want to mess this up. She's, you know, there's something about her that I just, and she's like, reminisce, what is, what is this? You, you know, like mm -hmm. she'd never, like, I'm never like that. <laughs> With, mm -hmm. She's like, this is, that's new. And, you know, of course I say, okay, well, this is what I'm saying to her. You think that's okay? And what I said was, um, I just, I kept it simple. I said, you know, hello there. I saw your profile on Tinder. I came across your profile on Tinder and I just wanted to compliment your photography works and also you're a very striking lady. Is it okay that you know, we can meet up for coffee soon? You know? And that's what I said. And I just put it out there. And of course, the it took a day and that was the fifth and she got, she replied back on the seventh and you know, she's like, hello, <laughs> you know, thank you uh, for your kind compliment. And, you know, unfortunately, I'm leaving uh, for the East Coast. And uh, she said, then I think to London or, or somewhere, you know, out of the States, but we can meet up for coffee. And that's how we first connected. And, you know, everything else just kind of came together, you know, slowly but surely.